All right, hello everyone. So today I'm going to be cooking a few things. This is going to be really, really funny because these are quite disgusting things. All right, so for today's cooking vlog, I have some leftover <laughs> meat and chips from yesterday. Um, yeah, I'm just put that in the pan. It looks really disgusting now, but it's gonna come out looking quite nice. Here are some eggs. Man, man. here's a bag of um, McCain's Quick Cook Mini Smiles Crunchy. I found it in the fridge, so this is gonna be very tasty as well. Excited to have this. Alrighty, well, let's get started. Alright, so now we're going to start with this cooking process. Um, I still have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, let me just, um, this is the oil that I was told to use. You should put the oil in that early before you heat the pan because the oil will burn. Uh, whoops. I'm just doing something to stop the toxins from spraying everywhere. Oh my god, screw it. Well, we don't want any toxins spraying anywhere. Yeah, I think to cook to start, we're going to start with this um, box of stuff. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I'm getting a kitchen. That has like an, an, an island in the center. I hate it against the wall. I realize that now. What do you mean by that? What do you mean things to put? Like imagine a kitchen here. Yes. Wouldn't that be better? Mm -hmm. Like, you know, like open space. Stove I guess. I thought a kitchen was meant to be in a more reserved, closed off area. No, I want, I want the kitchen to be the centerpiece of my house in future because that's where I'll be all day. Yes. Cooking. Right. And no one to yell at me for making a mess. That's a great idea. Right. Yep. I'm just watching fellas on my own YouTube. Watch those. Look at one video of the washers, and there are more videos. Yeah, I'm behind. I'm behind. Well, I mess. I mess turning it on, so now there's a noxious gas. This gas smell. It smells quite atrocious. So there you go. I turn it on. Yay. Oh, I just put the. Oh, it's quite close. Yep. I don't really know how to cook things. Uh, oh, 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 nearly turned it off. So this is pretty fun. All right, so let's um, let's start by cooking a few things. Uh, here to here are my tongs. Yep. Okay. No, this is quite disgusting every single way. We do have an air fryer and everything, but then if I were to use it, this would make for um, this video, unfortunately. So I'm just going to do it through this alternative route. Oops. Yeah, so the cheese on the top of the box can go right here. Little pieces of grilled chicken. There you go, yeah, that's good. Yep. Here are some of the chips from the previous night. Yeah, yeah, that'll be really good. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. No worries. You're gonna get yelled at, by the way. Why? I'm pretty sure that's gonna splatter oil like crazy. That's it, I'll use one of those um, oil. I'll use one of, I'll use the oil pump actually. No, but it's gonna get on the floor. That's good, okay, don't worry. Yes. 
That'd be a great tool in order to prevent um, any oil splash. It will splash though, because like, as soon as you remove it, it splatters. Okay, we'll so you've okay. got to turn off the stove after, only after, you got to turn off the stove and then afterwards remove it. Yep. And when you remove it, the oil will be sticking to it, so make sure you transfer over the oil. Alright. Okay. Alright, we're still frying up. Well, the oil coming out from the cheese, unfortunately. I think you meant to flip this, but then uh, not necessarily. I'm um, very excited because the oil is going nuts right now. Turn off the stove right here. I guess this is when I'm going to flip it. But there's a lot of cheese right now. It's not looking very enjoyable. Very tasty. Oh, am I excited to eat this? Oh yeah. Yep, let me just flip this one. Alright, there you go. Right, right, yep. Alright, cover back on. I guess we are going to turn the um display back on. Oh jeez, it just breathed in some disgusting, noxious gas. Well, I'm just going to prepare the um, the eggs very soon. I have my eggs right here. I'll show you guys what it looks like. Very delicious. Sorry, I was checking the price of one of my um, NFT purchases. Uh, let me see, what is the price now? 0.37, okay. That's not too bad at all. I bought it at 0.15. And I mean, I don't really know how this all works. I, my brother gave me a suggestion and it really worked out. So that's really good. Yeah, we might as well prepare the spam right now, so. Yeah, might as well, I mean, you know, there's only a little big piece left. So yeah, so we just going to use the, uh, I don't think you guys can see this, but then I'm just going to use a knife and just cut these up into smaller little pieces. That's the general sort of idea of what I'm going to be doing here. Yep, there you go, so just move that, swish, oh, there you go, good, Gee, Yep, good. 
I'm actually just gonna, uh, I think I'll just move the camera back so I can just cut in front of you guys. So you can see the sort of cooking that I'm attempting to do. Maybe just one more. There you go. Good. Mm. All right. There you go. So these spam slices I cut now. Don't need to snipe anymore. Oops. Still there. Okay. I believe the chicken pieces are done now, I can just remove these, so yep. I need to find a way to move this, I need to find a position to move this, uh, this oil detector mechanism for the stove off first. Now we just um, remove these pieces and I guess I'll give it a go to start off with. Can't be too atrocious. In fact, I might even say it'll be quite tasty. Yeah, so the cheese is completely solidified on the back and bottom here and everything. It's been melted, very solidified. It's got that very nice crispy edge. Yep. and then we're gonna get to cook we're gonna start cooking the spam first. Quite a lot of oil here actually so it's gonna be quite a mess. Or oil from the actual cheese and the actual meat. to some of the meat again. Oh! Some oil just coarse going on here. You can smell the cheese. You can smell the cheese. Right, there you go. Good. Lots of fun. Yeah. I guess we'll start. Anyways, let's try this first. See how this tastes. Little chicken piece right here. So it looks like quite burnt. Definitely massively overcooked. Mm. Mm. It tastes absolutely hard. Oh my god. I think that should have been air fried. Sorry, he's checking the um, price of space punks again. What is that? 0.38, right? All right. All right. Oh, yeah. Yes, it is flashing quite a lot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
And this is always just a pleasurable activity to do. Unfortunately, I'm missing out on um, the identity being ranked here. I do want to play some ranked games right now. Uh, yeah. Oh well. Alright, let's post um, ready to flip again. Maybe a tiny bit more. It's always nice to have some spam and eggs. I think it's always good. I'll just get the egg ready. Discord and you can hear me. Uh, that would be really awkward. Alright, uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay. Just gonna crack it along the side of this plate. I don't wanna do it on the pan, it's a bit too hot. Okay, great, that actually worked. Heat off and the egg still cooks quite significantly, so it's quite nice. Well, let me turn the heat back on actually. Alright, this is gonna be very, very excited to actually try. This actually looks not too atrocious at all. I'd be willing to eat this for sure. See the egg is actually quite bubbling right now. I'll show you. I don't know how to interpret this. Okay. Alright, here it is, this is what it looks like. Mm, there's some odd bubbling going underneath the egg, that's the oil. And that's not gonna go very well. I feel like it's gonna burst very soon. Let's come back on. Yeah. Alright, well I'm now protected from the oil, so I really can't always leave it. I'm not sure when to tell, how to tell whether a scrambled egg is done. Mm, I guess it's done. I guess we can just turn the heat off now. Alright, now let's just move it all onto a plate. I'm not sure if I really want to eat. I mean, I'll try another little piece. Um, you actually can hear it, it's a... Uh, it's actually a stiff rock. Well, that's not the chicken, that's just the cheese. This is also uh, not very tasty. Ugh. It was certainly tasty when I ordered a fresh new beads yesterday. Not so much now. Let's just remove the food. So, no, I'll just put it here actually. I don't want the ceramic to potentially be compromised. Yes, that's perfect because I didn't want to. Oh, great, the spam actually attached to the egg. 
It's very convenient to pull out. Yeah. Like that. Well, that's very convenient. We're gonna get a bit of a blend of the um, Spam with the cheese and everything like that. I'll call this the uh, Spam and, I'll actually call this the um, Spam and Egg Tower. So you can see that the, um, the egg is protruding because there was a block of Spam underneath it. That's very humorous. I'll just get some pepper here, and then we can start eating. Salt and pepper, sorry. Or maybe just pepper. All right, we'll try pepper. All right, yeah. I'll try again. Screen Screen pick and roll. Okay. I'll support it like this. It's my phone on top of the actual plate like this. There they go. Perfect. All right, time to eat. I don't think you're going to really like that at all. I think it's going to be quite disgusting. Oh, really? Interesting. All right, all right, we're done now. Okay. <clears throat> Here it is, let's try it. This is a spoon because I don't have any fork or anything like that to eat this spam with. Mmm. Well, the flavor of the spam is definitely blended with the cheese. The pepper's nice though. Let's try the egg. Mmm. That's quite nice as well. I definitely want a bit too much pepper. The yolk is now split and I think it's undercooked. Oh well. Mmm. Mm. Spam is quite pleasant, yeah. Mm. My apologies, so what happened there was that actually I was burning to the end. I think there was some sort of crust on the cheese or something like that. And I bit into it, it's sort of just a little wedge between my gum. Mm. Along the sort of my mouth and everything, it was bit on, over that and it was quite painful. Yeah, it's not very good. Mm. There's a nice little crust over it. Just getting the yolk out. It's not the spam. 
Just spin the egg yolk right here. Mmm, yeah. Alright, well, I think I'm done eating now. Thank you very much for watching, if you haven't watched my video. Again, you really have no idea as to why you've been I'm staying for this long. Or maybe skip to the end of the video, but yeah. Uh, yeah. Let me skip to the end of this video. I still appreciate the fact that you have decided to actually watch, at least even try to main and stay on this video even after a very boring introduction. Because, you know, if you went to the end of the video, you would have watched the introduction or part of it, and then the ending is all. I thank you for having made the decision to actually watch the actual ending and everything. Like, that's very good. You know, because you could have just left off the introduction so by staying for the ending I and watching this. I thoroughly appreciate you. Alright, yes. Alright, goodbye. Sure.